this scenario, I'm going to explain how to delete an incorrectly imported transaction. In the debtor financing account, all transactions are manually imported. So there is not an active feed. Everything is manually imported from um, a CSV file. So occasionally um, duplicates are imported. If I click down here on the reconcile item, the transaction I actually want to delete is this. This was incorrectly imported, it's a duplicate. And to delete it, I can come over here, click on this red cross, up pops this window, delete statement line, click yes, and that deletes it. I'm just going to uh, quickly show you another method to delete it. So I, what I've done is reinstall it. And the other way you could delete it is by coming from this window, clicking on bank statements. Now I just resized the window to fit here. Click on search on the right side over here. Enter the amount. I'm selecting exact amount because I know the exact transaction I want to delete. And here it has popped up here. Come over to the left here. Notice that I have statement lines selected here. That automatically, at the moment, it just always pops up as statement lines. Select here and I would delete. The bank statement area is the area if you need to delete a lot of transactions that have been incorrectly imported, whereas the reconcile tab just for one or two. So I'm going to click delete there, click delete there. And what's actually great about this is it is deleted, but it still kind of stays there in a ghost state. So it's not real. It's not affecting any transaction in zero. However, it's there in a ghost state. So if you do accidentally delete it, you could just come over here and restore it. So that was how to delete uh, an incorrect transaction that has uh, found its way into zero.